All right, All right. let's get started. Hey, friends. Welcome Here back. Here we are. We've got this drunk. He thinks that we're the Duchess's Ooh. favorite. And I think, <laughs> fight me. So last time we decided we were going to go visit Guillaume in the Medic's tent, right? Bones. Were we? Yeah. I've changed the quest for us in advance. You sure did. Mm-hmm. Why were we visiting him? I don't know. And I don't remember, he? but we, but we, let's read the quest text. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to Anthropology, everybody. This uh, is the professionalism that you expect of us. <laughs> oh, I think you picked it because it was the lowest level one oh, that we yes. had. Yeah, I, and it sounded reasonably interesting. Tradition has sanctified two codes of conduct in Toussaint, the teachings of the prophet Lebioda and the chivalric principles which guide its knights. These latter call for young men to prove their abilities yeah. through feats of daring during tourneys. Oh, that's right. That's Guillaume who has got injured by the shalma. Okay. Okay, cool. Nice. Let's go visit him as is a suggested. What am I doing? Friends, I... we have snacks and uh, Momo has been amazing and provided for a rocher. For a So I'm excited about that. Um... I realise it's a little way away, but I think I'm actually gonna hone. Okay, do it. Because Get on um, that horse. I just wanna I wanna like see the world. The environment's really pretty, eh? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. I'm really enjoying I'm really enjoying this expansion. The other one was really good too. This one hits the spot in terms of um, extra content. Um no, I'm just gonna pop up here and Duchess see if we can Anna sell anything. Henrietta. Cause we've got like not much room in our bags right now. We nearly abdurdent. Yeah. Um, mm. I think it might have to go in on the other side. Fair and fair, was right and fair. So pretty. It is pretty. Can I get in this way? Can get in somewhere. Oh, look, let's go by dress. Yeah. Can I take this? No? Bummer. Mm. Um... It's there for the taking. No one's around. No, I know. No one will, no one will even notice <laughs> <laughs> until later. Um, okay. Yes. Progress. Reading progress. Okay, Is here we go. Maybe because... Here we go. Here oh, we okay, go. Okay, okay. Now we're in the right place. Okay, mate. Can I hang the selfie? Best armor around. I don't care. <sighs> Need something crafted. You willing? I don't actually. I just want to get rid of things. Sell some things. Can we repair some things? It's probably a good idea, oh, right? Yeah, good point. Just repair expensive. them all. It's yeah. Pretty expensive. Well, whatever. I think it's worth doing though, because you know you have to do it where eventually, is, regardless. Where's the shop? Here we go. Okay. Um. Lift. This. You. Why don't we have our swords equipped? What do we have equipped? I don't know. Oh, uh, maybe we've got the, we've got, oh, the fucking ass ears. <laughs> <laughs> we wore those for such a long time. They were great. They were great. <laughs> um, all right. Uh, cool. Thank you. So long. So long. So long. I'm Kakui. He is the epitome of Kakui. <laughs> yeah. Uh, we are wearing Iris and, ah, oh, that's right, okay, we cool, made cool, the cool. Viper Sword. So it might be worth us, uh, next time we're at Corvo Bianco, to just pop these in. The chest. The chest. Yes. Yeah. Um. Ah! Ah! I just dropped the controller <laughs> on the floor. Whilst Over we here. rustle. <laughs> rustle around getting chocolate. No yeah. mouse sounds allowed in this episode. Oh there? my gosh, friends, there was an episode with the blueberries. It wasn't, it wasn't uh, The Witcher though. Fuck. I told you about that. We did it. So wet. <laughs> I lied, there are mouse sounds. <laughs> Just because I'm being a dick. Mm. Okay. I, uh, I hope that wherever you are in the world, you have holiday treats as well. Yeah. Mmm. If you could tell us what your favourite holiday treats are and what holiday they relate to, I'd love to know. Yeah, for sure. Okay. Where are we going? 
We're, I'm walking to Gium. North. I just got distracted. It's not that far. With uh, making a bit of space in our bags. How the fuck do I get out of here? Where is the door? It's too fucking dark in here. Okay. Mm, I'm going to tell the internet about my colleague who got trashed the other day. Oh, yes, do that. But first, can we, <laughs> could, could, is it, do you want to share what your favourite holiday treats Race, are? No mm, um, no oh, no, but now I have to think about it. There's so, is there so many? I don't know. I definitely think Ferrero share a big one for me. They are, but I didn't, for Christmas. I didn't have that until I was a little older, though. Mm, because oh. they were too expensive when we yeah. were kids, right? I don't even think I had them as a child. Um, what did I have as a child? Oop, yep. We had scorched almonds when we were Oh, kids. yes. Yep, definitely had scorched almonds. Still enjoy those. Yeah, but they're ma um, made by Nestle, so I don't buy them. You can get non-Nestle ones, though. You can, but they're a wee bit harder to find. Um, homemade biscuits, so things like gingerbread. We tend to oh, have yeah. those sorts of things. Um, what else did we have? No, I just think of like food on Christmas Day. Mm, mm, around chicken. It. Roast chicken. Um, my turkeys aren't really a thing here, by the way. I feel. Oh, apparently they're really hard to get here. Yeah. I've never tried because first of all, I'm vegetarian. Second of all, we just it's, it's not part of the. Is that that's not Corvo Bianco, is it? No. Patrolling on an empty stomach. Yeah, off. it looks like a army thing, army barracks or something. I think I told you about this before, but my mum makes this amazing carrot salad. It doesn't sound amazing, but it is. I think you have told me about this, and, but tell the story of the carrot salad. Uh, it's it's got you know standard things in it like carrots and um, salad. celery, and um, it uses like tomato soup as a as a sauce, as a base, and there's other things in it too. Oh. Anyway, um, both my sister and I are obsessed with this carrot salad, and every year we ask her to make it. Uh, and we've even both got the recipe from her and watched her do it year upon year. We're like, this year we're going to get it. And then we both try it, and it's not the same. It's never the fucking same. And we even huh. use the same brand stuff, and we use, you know, like oh nothing. Oh, my gosh. You don't have the neck. We don't have the neck. Can't do it. Which it? I have a matter of prime urgency and import. There he is. I must speak to you. Yeah. That's sure, I bet for. it's about a girl. Because he's like obsessed. Hey, he's Your got wound. Fancy. Feeling better? It's healing splendidly, though I am to avoid trouble for some time. To be frank, that is precisely why I wish to speak with you. Russell, Russell. I need to stand in for you. Take on some trouble on your behalf. That could very well be the case. You see, there is a maiden, nay, a lady. I suspect someone's cast an ill spell upon her. A curse, perhaps. Why? Because she's not into you? That's what I wondered as well. <laughs> <laughs> Let me guess. She suddenly grew cold, haughty, and distant, though the night before she was flirtatious and alluring. <laughs> tut tut, Witcher. You jest, yet the matter is grave. Though true, the lady in question is dear to my heart. I shall not deny it. I fear she has fallen victim to ill magic and knows no one she could turn to for help. Why do you think she's cursed? What makes you think she might be cursed? You must keep all I say to yourself, I beg you. I would never dare to be so indiscreet normally, yet I'm troubled about her, for her. Vivian shuns the company of others. Though the fairest maid at court, she keeps men at a distance. I thus determined I would resort to trickery. <laughs> trickery? That even befitting of a knight? It's amazing. <laughs> In war, yes. And what is love if not battle? As it were. One evening, I crouched in hiding outside her seamstress's home. As Vivian emerged from it, I too emerged, ever so gently but convincingly collided with her, then promptly offered to escort her home. She consented. At first, all argued well. I proposed a more scenic route. She agreed. I made kindly forays into conversation, and she even began to respond as we neared the end of our route. Oh, my God. Then suddenly... Then suddenly, mid-speech, from her mouth there flew a most hideous shriek. I stopped stone cold in my tracks while she turned red, then promptly ran off. I did not give chase that time. Good. I attempted to approach her on several ensuing occasions, to learn what had happened. 
for I feared she had become entangled in some trouble. I noted that often come night she ventures into the woods where I've seen her walk about a glade near a pool. I've striven on occasion to follow her, but lost track each time. It seemed then she'd melted into the air. That's because you're being a creep. She's scared of you. Okay, mm. I realise this is a story and it is going to probably turn out that she has some ghosts wanting her or something like that. But don't Full follow women in forests at night time. Or in anywhere at night time. <laughs> uh, sound... you want to get to know somebody, that is not a way to do it. Meet them in public where they feel safe. So it says sound might not have, might not have been a stranger. Yeah. Yeah. Sound you heard. She might have just had a sore throat. Had I thought it possible the sound was natural, I never would have taken up your precious time. Okay. Notice any other strange behavior? Additional symptoms? No, Vivian's avoided me wholly since the first encounter. But folk gossip. What about? They say she's secretive, that no one ever sees her after dusk. That she's wont to suddenly disappear. Nothing unusual about any of that. Maybe she's a vampire. Yeah. Except that would be the opposite, right? <laughs> a banshee? Tell me more about Vivian. Who is she? What's her story? She's her enlightened highness's lady-in-waiting. Her mother was a lady-in-waiting. Her father, a knight. That is all I've learnt, for the Duquesa grows angry when asked about her. Vivian mm. spends her days within the palace walls. Yet we are in luck, for she has been named a tourney's patroness this year. Thus, each participant will be granted an audience with her. Got a problem then. See, I'm not a participant. Mm. I've devised a solution already. You shall take my place in the lists and thus gain the chance to speak to her. I was looking forward to winning the tourney, very much so. Yet for Vivian, I am prepared to sacrifice anything. I guess the thing here is, even if it turns out, like, this is a nice opportunity so, to either find out whether something is weird, or if she's just not interested, and we can tell them to back the fuck off. Yeah, So, true. either or, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, so, uh, yeah. This tourney, how's it work exactly? It is the year's grandest and most important contest. Are we going to joust? from all corners come to face off for the grand prize, and more importantly, for glory. A demanding like test of knightly appears. prowess in horsemanship, marksmanship, and fencing. I qualified for the first time, had great hopes of winning. Yet... Yeah, I get it. Anything for Vivian. Okay, give me lots of money. Hardly your regular job, this. Not often I gotta take part in attorney to fulfill a contract. Fee can't be anything ordinary either. I'm no magnet to command heaps of coin, but naturally I shall award you a just amount. How much do you demand? Ooh. Oh, that is actually That's good. That's a decent. Let's see if Izzy's technique. I mean, just under half. Just under half. About there? Yeah, roughly. I have comrades I can ask. They would surely lend me coin. Oh. Yet even that would not be enough. Could you not lower your fee somewhat? He's not very annoyed, though, so it mustn't be yeah. far off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Agreed. That is an there amount I can indeed muster. I wish that was less... Uh... Same samey? Because, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. like, why bother having that as a mechanic if it's always the exact same spot? Oh, pretty. That's a pretty bit. Fine. Yeah. I'll look into it. Gotta admit, piqued my curiosity. I shall be forever in your debt. Now, we must ensure you are not eliminated from the tourney before you can meet Vivian. Why can't Meaning... we just, like, ask the Duchess to. Could Let you show me it. how you shoot, ride, and fight, perchance? <sighs> and you must learn the tourney rules, know how <laughs> to apply them in practice. I, a... I did not mean to suggest <laughs> I doubt your abilities. No! Train, even a witcher. <laughs> don't Besides, want to! the tourney contests must surely differ. Require skills you don't usually apply. Races, above all. No! The choice is yours. Where shall we start? <laughs> Fuck me days! <laughs> uh, oh. Should we say this? I mean, I think no, you probably no. should. Uh, I'll do target practice. Okay. Marksmanship. Feel a need to do some shooting. Okay. Come with me. All right, well, hurry up then, mate. 
the marksmanship contest shall pit you against another for the best time and score. He who hits all his targets first wins. Hope my oh. is as good as that Cupid's who shot you. Sometimes when you speak, I miss the meaning entirely. Yeah, it's because you're a fucking idiot. Oh, man. Oh, this is the worst. Get the red targets. The red targets. Okay. Oh, shit. What's my fucking crossbow button? Ah! I hate this. No! Fuck, it's a good thing I did practice. So one really in the unnatural. Bottom middle is white, so just Have I done it? Oh uh, no. Uh where where Sorry, are the, the middle middle is. Where are the rest? Top, 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 top. Ah. Oh. The one in the middle is white, I think. What about that one? Yeah. Once more? Yes. Remember I had to do the, um, uh, play. Yeah, Glad but you only had to try. do it like three times. Sure, but it was apples on someone's head. <laughs> That's <laughs> true, slightly them. more pressure. <laughs> this is so hard with a controller. Yes. Ah! You're doing great. If I had a fucking mouse, I'd be able to do this in two seconds. Yes. Perfect. Is that all? Okay, cool. Alright, double. <sighs> Once more? No, it's enough, thank you. Done enough shooting. Where to now? If you wish to know my thoughts, were I you, I would train on the race course ahead of all else. Okay, fine. Ugh. Let's do some riding. Roach will like that. I hope you Excellent guys can't idea. hear my washing machine going. I'm sure it's fine. Come That's fine. Hurry up! Fucker! Hurry up! The tourney's race differs from others you might have taken part in. You shall not ride against any opponent. How's it a race at all, then? It's a race against time. Ah. The true track begins in the arena, runs round the tourney grounds, then finishes again in the arena. The training track, however, lies beyond the arena. We shall go there now. Well, they shouldn't be bumping into other people. Oh my gosh, there are so many people just screaming <laughs> random <laughs> shit. I couldn't hear anything that Guillaume was saying there. Guillaume? Fucking French, man. Well, look. Whoop. Okay, so he's like, it starts in the thing. And then I will like all is ready. All I could hear. Now listen, for it can be quite a challenge. Along your route stand dummies and targets. The <gasps> dummies you may cut with your blade. The targets no! you must oh hit my from your gosh. crossbow. The time what? you have to complete the course shall increase each time you land a strike. Oh, Momo's glaring at me. <laughs> it may well, sound I wasn't glaring enough, at yo. I was glaring at the Many concept. a night fail this contest and hang his <laughs> head in shame. During the race proper, judges throughout the course shall tally your points. For now, you may ride unperturbed by those matters. This is like the worst thing in the entire world. Okay, holding down an attack button will trigger a slow motion mode, which makes it easier for you to strike your target. Okay, good. Geralt will decide for himself which side to attack from based on your enemy's location. Holding down the aim button, which for reference is this button. Thank you. Uh, we'll trigger a slow motion mode, same thing. You don't need to hold down the gallop button. Okay, great. So you don't have Sorry to Sorry about, about all the cars going by. I might actually close that window. Oh, yeah. All right. Perhaps not. Oh, so... I had a dream last night. There was a massive earthquake. And at first I was like, ha, 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 I'm so used to earthquakes, I'm not even bothered. And then the whole house started Ooh. falling sideways down the hill, and the cat was in the house with me, and I was like, oh my gosh, I have to protect my cat. And then I was also <laughs> trying to, like, grab all the televisions and screens in the house, because they were all falling. <laughs> that sounds like a stress dream. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, classic. Um, so... Uh, if you have someone who is a mounted combat, it sounds like it will slow down. That's great. Yeah. You can just strike from the I side. I just hold it. 
mounted um, mounted markmanship. This is good that you don't have to maintain Roach. She will just do her thing. Cool. Let's try it and see faster how it goes. Nice. Okay. Come on. Okay, there's one. Oh, nice. Is that what that is? Okay. Okay, I missed. So I have to let go of it. Oh, heal. so there's a. I think there was one there. Oh yeah. Ah, 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 fuck me days. Oh, this sucks so much. At least you're finding out where they are as well. I hate this. This is the worst. Oh shit! Fuck me days. Nope, missed that one too. <laughs> this is what the practice is for. I might have to get you to do this. Oh, well, I'm, I can't guarantee that yes, you I will. will. You'll be so much better at it than me. Okay, 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 okay. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go. Oh, wow, this is so hard without a fucking mouse. Holy shit. Yeah. Keep going, we, Roach. We could change, oh, no, we've tried this before. I was like, we could change it to the mouse, but because we're not familiar with the controls, it actually doesn't help that much, eh? Ah, oh, nice. Yeah, perfect. Run, Roach. Oh, la, 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 la. Chop. Chop his head off. You're right, it is helping that. What? What do you mean I'm leaving it's the racetrack? Fuck, fuck. Did I get it? Nope. Nope. <laughs> okay. okay. Do you want to try? I can give it a go. Will you give it another go? I can set out more dummies. Yes. I. I'll set out your dummy. No harm in going so, again. So, R1. Yeah, it's yours, yours. No, no, no. <laughs> R1 and then just strike. Okay, cool. cool, cool yeah, cool. hold it and release. The strike? Go. Just strike. Okay. So, this one? Yep. Nice. Okay. Do, do, do. Okay, and... Ah, fuck. Oh, surprisingly hard, eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh... And then we have this one coming up, so... Wow, thanks, thanks. <laughs> wow. Thanks, game. Apparently I'm leaving the track. Yeah, I see that. I see that's, that's a problem. That's it, Roach. Oh, yeah. Oh, you totally got that. They no, should have aim assisted you there. I didn't, but it's alright. Cool, 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 cool. Nice. Yeah. And we will see if we can get the other two things. Okay, okay. So, let's see, friend. Huh. Oh, what? You totally got that. Bullshit. I didn't have any time left, did I? Okay. No, my no time. Mm. So, have you had enough, or do you wish to ride again? Might go one more time. Yeah, do it nice. again. I feel like no, if I'm I could have done it again. one more time, I would have been Practice a lot more confident. Oh, do you want to go? No, no, you do it. You do it. I cannot guarantee we will do well in the race. We'll try. This is why we avoid these clues, because we actually don't. Nice. It was perfect. No, the trick with this one down here is that you have to go off the course a little bit. Yeah, and you're kind of coming around the corner a wee bit. Ah, I think I did that too early. That's okay, good to know. Let's try this one. Let's come round and then stay on the bridge. Yeah. It's so hard. Just be a bit faster about that one. I reckon if we don't get this one, we should try it with mouse and keyboard. Oh, that's a good idea. And see, this one you're kind of coming up to it in a straight line, so yeah, it's quite straightforward, as it were. <laughs> <laughs> um, and the same with that first dummy. You know, they're kind of mm -hmm. good angles of approach. So, I mean... Uh, I reckon it might even be worth slowing down a little bit. Just so that you can, like... 
Didn't even really slow down, did you see? Like, the, there was no time slow. Interesting. You have to hold it. Yeah. Hold it down for the time slow. Nice, you got it that time. Awesome. All right, so I've missed one. I've got three. And the time's running out. All right. Hmm. Come on now. Will you give it another go? I can set I up more dummies. Fine. I don't know. I've had enough. Okay. I mean, had if we enough. fucking fail, we fail. You Rather know what I mean? I'll wear my horse down before yeah. the real race. Where to now? I guess we're doing combat training. Be nice to swing, do some footwork, work up a sweat. Very well. We shall practice infantry combat one on one. Each knight opts for his own method. Rainfarn, for instance, fights halberd in hand. Oh, that's probably the easiest one, right? Come with me. Well, we've certainly got the most ex uh, you will experience team with, with other just knights fighting. to fight. Well, it should the just be a regular fighting. A true isn't? skirmish during battle. Come the end, you shall fight a duel. It will determine your place on the podium. I always liked the duels the best, but now I can think only of my Vivian. Ugh. In the end, it is good you will replace me. I sense I would simply be distracted this time. And last trump on a wisdom lies stripped of Just people screaming in the background. It's <laughs> quite extreme. Yeah. Man, there's so many NPCs in this. I guess it's to show that it is a, it's, a, it's an event, right? Yeah. It's an tournament. It's a tournament. Stand at the center of the training ground. A knight will approach and challenge you. Okay. Let's fucking do it. Stand and fight, but be warned, I do nothing halfway. I swear hey. On my honor. Hang on. Can I? Oh, I can't put on oils. Ah, uh, and we can only what punch? Of course, they're not gonna let us just murder. Oh, right. yes, they are gonna let us murder. Them. Can you use your signs? Probably not. No. Attack! <sighs> oh, but we do have our sword, which does. Yes. Yeah, it does. Amazing. Nice. I've never done a counterattack before. Hmm. I just did it. I just did a block before. Yeah, that was good. It was good. Amazing. Do you wish I don't think we're in trouble with that. Nah. Yeah, I'm pretty pretty comfortable. Yeah. I think I've fighting. seen enough. Sorry to be blunt, but the simplest Witcher contract demands more skill than this kind of combat. <laughs> True. <laughs> Now you must go to the inscription tent. Honor and glory are all true and good, but your scrolls must be in order. You better not send me to window A and then window B and then window A and then window C and then downstairs and upstairs. And then back to window A. Before you bribe somebody. Yeah. Which way are you sending me, friends? Okay. We have to go past shouting woman again. Yeah. I don't even know what she's saying. No, I couldn't catch it either. She was just like, well, <laughs> <laughs> That's the technical term. I'm just going to sneak over here to this. Oh, okay, there's a barber. Yeah. Is that truly are we, are we, is it time? No. No, no, not? no. Ow. Okay. Um, okay. Because we at the start of the last. Where are you heading? Oh, to the armor. What's that? Where are you heading to the armor? Yeah, I just want to um, get the thingy on. Oh, there isn't one. I thought there might be a um... grindstone or whatever it's called. Oh yeah, there is one. Ooh. Yeah. Move. Move. <laughs> uh, and there's also a thingy. Cool. Okay. Nice. A little advantage for me. I'm really enjoying our haircut. Yep. Yes. Was that truly necessary? And our knights Push, 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 push. People just enjoying their lovely outing, and we are push running, just pushing people with our hands. Oh, what's this? Read, read, read. Halmaran Tales Anesis Don Mir Rain Farm Corn Guy Elonis and Delwyn. Is that the people in the competition? Or is that the people who have been killed by the vampire? Or I assume in the tournament, given Yes. Nice. R three. Uh the International Knights Tourney under the patronage of 
Lady Vivian del uh, de Tebris. 1275. Participants registered and qualified to take part in the contest. Uh, Gregoire de Gorgon, winner of last year's tourney, he shall not participate in the general competition, but shall fight in the final bout against the knight who earns the most points. All signs seem to indicate Gregoire will defend his title. Uh, Ancest, Prince of Lyria and Rivia, join us oh. for the third time in a row. I wonder if we'll get to talk to that person. Yeah. Well, Geralt of Rivia, right? Yeah, exactly. Horm Akaspark, Prince of Mact. Rumoured to be the Emperor em Emir's blood, here for his fourth tourney. What the fuck? Baron Palmian de Lornfall, his sixth time in the tourney. Don, uh, Don Emir of Troy, a Redanian knight, his first time in the tourney. Renfan of Atra, Atra, for the seventh time in the tourney. Victor of 1269 edition. I love whenever they mention the years and stuff, because I have no There's idea nothing. what the actual year is, so it just is like... You just like nod, like mm. a thousand years ago, or yesterday, two? or <laughs> <laughs> Guy de <Yeah>. Bois Fresnes <laughs> um, of Matina, a second cousin of Reina uh, de Bois, same guy, one of her grace's knights errant, third time in the tourney, Delwyn of Creagall, a young knight in the tourney for the first time. It's interesting um, coming across words which you're not super familiar with. It's kind of mm. yeah. Um, Tay de oh, Tay of Tale? Tale. I'm inclined to not pronounce the L's, but mm -hmm. um, no idea. Tay of Dawndal, a knight of the Order of the Flaming Rose. Ah, mm. first time in this tourney. Lenos of Metina, third time in the tourney. Guillaume de Lornfall. Baron Palmer's nephew. Oh, yeah. Ah. First time in the tourney. Later addendum. Due to injury, Guillaume has transferred this his place in the tourney to another knight. Right. Okay. Scribe. Tis I. Want to join the lists? Naturally. We must first see to formalities, however. At Guillaume's request, I have looked into your personal history in its heraldic aspects. Really? What did you come up with? My findings show you may take part as Geralt of Rivia. What a surprise. Or as the Honorable Ravix of Forhorn. It's not every year we have a combatant who can boast of two crests. Which do you prefer? Do we get to choose? What the fuck? Oh, we do get to choose. Oh, oh, which colors? Which are the which is which which? Uh. I don't know. Hang on, okay, uh, I'm excited. <laughs> I'm overwhelmed. Let's look at the bottom options. What can they tell us? Yeah. Ravix of Forhorn? How'd you manage to dig that up? Here in Toussaint, we treat heraldry very seriously. One visit to the Ducal Archives. That is all I needed to acquire the necessary information. Oh, I like this. Ravix Chris. of Forhorn was the name under which you attended a feast honoring Princess Pavetta daughter of Queen Calanthe of Sintra on the occasion of her 15th birthday. Hmm. That was That's serious, Mum. Right. Oh. And what about... It's really throwing me off that the scribe has the face of the pallor. <laughs> <laughs> such like a like, weird and wacky character. And <laughs> sure. <laughs> kind of curious what you could have learned about Geralt of Rivia. In the year 1267, a certain Geralt, a member of the Witches' Guild, was knighted by Queen Meave and dubbed Geralt of Rivia. This was in honor of his distinguished service at the Battle of the Bridge, said structure spanning the Yaruga. But I wager you know of which battle I speak. Mm. Yeah, those were the days. Kahir and I led a fistful of Nordlings against an entire Nilfgaardian battalion. Won that battle just because we absolutely had to cross the river. Okay. Um, what are you feeling? Okay, I'm torn. Because one, I love that crest with the lady on the bear. Yes. Um, but it feels, it doesn't feel genuine, does it? Yeah, and Geralt addresses himself as Geralt of Rivia. So, like, that's, like, the title he uses. So I kind of yes. want to use that. Plus, 
because there's someone else, there's a Prince of Rivia, and we don't know anything about Rivia. No. Um, I'd love if that kind of caused some connection, connection, right? or if like there was a conversation that happened because of that. So, and the um, the crest and the shield and everything are for that, which is the red and white, is perfectly acceptable. Yeah. Um, I do like. I feel like the fact that they've given us a choice makes me think that something mean something interesting might happen like maybe us being a bit anonymous would be good yeah that's the only other other thing right um but for me this sure ravix of fourhorn just feels like it's come completely out of the blue yeah um you know it's not come up in the game we've played before so um it feels almost like an Easter egg for people who've read the books. Possibly, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's nice. I like it. I like you. I really enjoy the crest, and and it's kind of a nice sort of story that I, we just got a little glimpse into. Yeah, but um, like, did we make up that title at the time? That's what it sounds like, <laughs> and because of that, it's, if it were like the one with here, yeah, Girl Reveal, where that is first of all who how he identifies, and that's also what he's been knighted as. If for some reason he also was knighted somehow as Ravix of Fourhorn or something like that. Yeah. Um, rather than uh just turned up to a party and called himself that. Yeah. You know? Yeah. All right, let's go with Rivia then. Okay. And we'll see what happens. I'm Geralt, not about to fight under a false name. Cool. You may now take the shields bearing your crest. Ugh. I'm a witcher. Shields aren't something witchers ever use in combat. Who mentions using it in combat? Not I. The shield commemorates your participation in the tourney. You may take it as a souvenir. Cool. Mm. In that case, thanks. Have you oh. been instructed as to the tourney's challenges, prizes, and vows? Just prizes? If not, I do hope you will allow me to tell you about them. Yeah, I want to know about the prizes. Um, Let's ch- yeah, prizes first. <laughs> Gonna come right out with it. I'm a sucker for prizes. You know what? Oh, fuck. The winner You're of each contest oh, shall fuck. receive a trophy. Whoever has the best Just result a trophy. which all contests have played out shall face last year's champion. Can we sell the trophy? The final duel oh, I don't want to win. I don't want to be back here next year. Should you defeat the reigning champion, the oh, grand the prize now. will be yours. This year, a sword forged especially Ooh. for this occasion mm, okay, by the one and one. only Cornelius <laughs> of Asengard. A famed master weaponsmith. Her illustrious highness had it brought all the way from Nazaire. Okay. All right. What are these vows? I'm not keen on vows. You say something about vows? As is our custom, knights make vows to which they hold for the duration of the tourney. Okay. Each swears on something which to him represents his most cherished... It's only for the duration of the tourney. Our vow. Okay. Sorry, uh, I'm just having headphone issues. Headphone issues. Uh, yeah. be resolved shortly. And tell, tell us. us about these challenges. Guillaume told me a bit about the contests. Rather make sure I'm clear on them, though. An admirable thirst for knowledge. There are contests three. A shooting uh-huh. range, where you will compete side by side with an opponent. A horse race during which you will seek to complete the course within a specified time. Okay. Any targets hit with bolts or dummies felt with blade will increase the time you have. Okay. Finally, the group melee in the arena, crowned with a duel against last year's champion. Sure. As each contest ends, its results will be posted on the board outside my tent. This way, all will be apprised of who leads at any given moment. Nice. I'm really glad that by this point, point we have a really nice set of armor. Yeah. Because it makes us feel so much more respectable. It does, doesn't it? Um, okay, that's all we need to know. Feels like I know everything I'd ever want to know about chivalric tourneys. Splendid. In that case, you must make your vow. Ooh. Upon what would you like to swear it? Uh, what's, what is the vow? Uh, ooh, uh, mm, mm-hmm, mm-mm. What's... <laughs> I make that sound because... Sure. I solemnly vow on the heron that in competing I'll respect the chivalric virtues. May the gods succor you in your endeavors to overcome. Sign here, please, then fill out these forms. 
<laughs> that is all I need from you. Now, as arranged by Guillaume, you shall be fitted with appropriate armor for the tourney. No, oh. I want my armor. Oh, right, of course, that's all. Shiny. You have also been assigned a tent for the tourney's duration. It stands near the arena. I need Good my luck. little tassels. Don't interfere with my armor. Hmm. My armor is better than any of your stupid armor. Oh my gosh. Oh my Should have gone with the bear armor. Like such a nerd. <laughs> it was right to go with, uh, you know, who we really are, but I prefer the other armor. Oh my gosh, we're such a nerd. Okay, shall we leave it there? Yeah, I just want to look at the stats on this armor. Fucking bullshit. Hmm. Bludgeoning and slashing resistance. It's probably a fine for this particular <sighs> scenario. I'm just curious. How does, it, how does it stack up against ours? Oh, it's actually good. Okay. Okay. Well, there you go. They haven't given us shit up. They didn't fuck us. They didn't fuck us. So that's, all right. that's all right then. And remember, we've got Iris on, which if you build up the red, oh, then yes. you use a strong attack, which is triangle. And, and it's it going to smack them hard. Smacks them really hard, yeah. yeah. Great. Okay. Um, I enjoyed that. Uh, yeah. And now we look like a nerd. We nerd. are a turny nerd. And uh, I just want to get a good good <laughs> shot of us so I can oh. use it for... Uh... Oh my gosh, we look like a fucking nerdy nerd nerd boy. We look like a member of Starfleet. Starfleet? <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, well, that concludes uh, this episode. And in the next one, poor Izza is the one who gets the uh, fun of Ooh, doing the things. Oh, yeah, that is pretty. And don't forget to tell us your favorite holiday snacks. Mm. I'm going to be quizzing Momo about snacks in the next one. Okay. Cool. We'll catch you then. See you then. Bye.